Good morning, welcome back to my channel. Subscribe down below and hit that like button and I really, really appreciate it. So today I have three appointments to go to. They're each two hours apart. So I'm gonna go to Dollarama in between the first one and then I'm gonna go to Costco in between the second one because it's in the city. And I have on these Lululemon joggers. These are the on the fly joggers and I love them because they're nice when I'm going to appointments because I can just pull them up so that I don't have to take my pants off when they're doing acupuncture or physio or anything like that. So I have Cairo acupuncture and physio today. I'm going to a new physio and I'm gonna try them so I'll let you know how that goes. But I have an hour and I'm just gonna take Ruger out because he likes to smell the yard before um, the first thing in the morning so then I can get that done so he's a happy camper when I leave. For breakfast, we're having two eggs with cinnamon and maple syrup. And to complement that, we are having the leftover pancake that I made yesterday. This is gonna be so good. There's our fast breakfast. Having pancakes made ahead of time really cuts down on a lot of cooking time. And then I'm gonna go to Costco today. So I um, have my list here. My mom wrote stuff down here to bother my husband, but. <laughs> Um, yes, yeah, so there's the list so far and we're just gonna add a few things. So I have three appointments today um, And they are all two hours apart. So I'm gonna do some errands in between but I thought I'd pack a little lunch These are turkey slices. These are the sweet potato crackers from Costco a guacamole for this and then a protein bar um, For later in the afternoon when I know I'm gonna get hungry So this is how I keep eating healthy during the day, but also save money by not eating out so I just finished at Cairo, um, I, that was a good visit with her. I used to go three times a week and then my benefits ran out so I'm doing it once a week now. I'm out of She's very warm and loving and has very good advice so I've been really happy with that. I am now drinking a vanilla cherry sparkling water. These things are so good, I showed them in my last video, they taste like a you're drinking coke and you're not like oh like amazing i want to try the ginger ginger ale one and the root beer i'm gonna try them all they have root beer and cream soda so now i'm going to the dollarama and i have to get a few things that we need um and then i have acupuncture after that okay so i just ran some errands i got a coffee um, usually on these kind of days when I have a lot of appointments, I get a coffee. It's also Thursday, so I've made it to like the end of the week. It's kind of like a little treat, and it's only Tim Hortons coffee. It's hot in here. So it's only $1.80. Um, anyways, I'm justifying it, but it's gonna be okay. So I went to the dollar store, and I got a notebook for when I start school. And I got Derek a notebook, because he's also starting school. Big things are happening for us this year. Um, I really feel like we're both moving in a good direction, so that's good. I got one of these notebooks. I use this every day. My other one is full. These notebooks from the dollar store are the, the best. I've bought in other notebooks, and I don't even write in them because I hate them. I love those ones. I got Derek an iPhone or a phone jack for his car because he um, likes to, or he needs one of these in the tractor to charge his phone. I got two things of batteries. These are for Ruger's Collar Light. Um, the batteries die fast, so it's probably because I buy them from the dollar store, I guess. And then I got these two stocking hangers. I was gonna buy some at Walmart, and my mom said she saw some at um, uh, the dollar store, so I got these. These were $2.50 each, and they say joy and peace, and then we already have one for Ruger, an uh, expensive one I bought at HomeSense with a paw. So that's good to go. I've been looking for those for a few years. And then I just went to the LCBO and my mom's birthday is tomorrow or Saturday. So I'm making her a little gift basket. So I got myself a box of wine because boxes are a way better deal. And then I got her a bottle of wine to put in her gift basket, even though I wanted to get her a box because it's a better deal. I thought that that would look a little unclassy. So yeah, that's my little haul. I have 20 minutes so I get acupuncture and then I'm gonna go to Costco I believe and then I have my last appointment of the day which is physio but it's like 40 minutes away I'm also gonna right now eat the rest of my lunch I'm gonna have the crackers guacamole and turkey that I packed while I sit here the worst part about 
being out and about nowadays or maybe it's just been always but I kind of notice it more now is that there's nowhere to go to the bathroom like if you go into Tim Hortons now you feel like you need to buy something because there's not a lot of people in there whereas before I don't know I'd just walk in and go and like gas stations I would go I don't know I just feel like there's like this weird thing now that you can't use the bathrooms anywhere so that's kind of frustrating so I was debating whether to get a coffee or not because I already went in Tim Hortons from this drink so I was like, whatever, I want a coffee. Hopefully I can find a bathroom. So I'm just gonna chow down here and I will talk to you in a bit. I'm finally home and I'm putting the first part of my Costco haul in our freezer in the garage. Um, so I have these chicken parmesan kievs. We buy the ham and Swiss ones usually, but I like to mix it up and get these ones every now and then. We get chicken bites every time jumbo chicken bites these are so good and then with both of those we like to have french fries so we buy this giant cavendish uh fries and we've probably gone through so many bags of these because we love them so that was all the stuff that needed to go in my freezer and ruger was home alone for like the longest time today since i've been off so i still have all this to bring in, I'll show you this. This is um, a blanket. It's a giant blanket. It's so soft and I got it for my mom for her birthday along with that bottle of wine. So that'll be her present. This giant thing of toilet paper. They are limiting them one per customer now because people are hoarding again, which I thought was smart because last time I went to Costco, they weren't limiting them and there was none left. I'm like, did you guys not learn the first time? But anyways, got our toilet paper so we should be good for a while now. I also got a rotisserie chicken for us for dinner. It smells so good. Another bag of Tostitos. This cake. It is honey roasted peanut butter and brownie. Like, sounds so good. And I'm going to bring that for my... Oh, no, I'm squishing it. I'm going to bring that for my mom's birthday. I, well, I'm more excited to try it than anything, but I'm sure she'll like it too. Um, two things of eggs. It's an 18-pack. 24 pack I believe of Oikos um, Greek yogurt and it comes with lime, vanilla, strawberry, banana, and cherry. This is the best deal you can find. Two bags of shredded cheese, um, this uh, box of Irish spring soap, this is what Derek uses. Hellman's, Derek goes through like one of these a month almost, like he loves Hellman's. I need a new cooking spray, turkey slices, and apples. That's all I got. I don't know how that came to $200, but it did. And now we are good for a while. So because I'm having rotisserie chicken tonight, I think I'm going to insert last night's dinner in here because it was really good. And yesterday I did not get out of my robe all day. So I don't feel like that was the most exciting day ever. So I might put um, last night's dinner and a few clips from yesterday uh, right here now. But thank you for watching. Subscribe down below and like this video for more content. And I am excited because it's almost the weekend. Not that that means a lot. And I'll see you in my next video. Stay safe. Just showered and got out of that robe for the first time today. It's really cold in our house, but I have the wood stove going now, so it's not too bad. So I feel really nice and clean now. Um, and I am starting dinner. It's only 5.20, but I'm bored, so I want to start it. So here's a tip. We're making tacos. I'm going to make them on the saute, and I like making them in the Instant Pot because for anybody who um, has a significant other working late or if you have kids who are just all over the place, this is a good tip because then I can, you can just leave it in the slow cooker on warm or in the Instant Pot on warm, and then it's ready to go at their convenience. You don't have to worry about heating it up or anything and it's just nice to have ready to go and they can just grab it and make their own tacos so there's a little tip okay so that is browned and I'm gonna add a little water because I like mine like saucy and then I have this taco seasoning from Costco it's the best I can definitely tell the difference when I use another one and then I just eyeball it I like a lot of seasoning Derek doesn't so I put a lot of seasoning, <laughs> but then just mix that up and then I'm just going to throw it on warm until it gets home. So I decided that I really wanted a quesadilla tonight, so I put on a little bit of um, cheese and beef here and then I'm going to make a quesadilla. I decided that I should probably have some vegetables, so I added some spinach. Yum. This is going to be so good.